everyone, Harriet here, and we're back to doing some Loot Crate openings, which I didn't think I'd be doing for a while. I mean, um, I haven't done the last couple of months, if you haven't seen my last video, I was in hospital, but the last two months were really good. They were, um, it was April or May, I can't remember which one, but music and then Unity. Music Box was really, really good because it had so much Miku Hatsune stuff headphones, t-shirts, lanyards, perfect for me. And the last box was Unity, so it had a Yokai Watch shirt, uh, a Goku pop figure, it even had a Full Metal Alchemist doormat. Where else are you going to get an anime doormat? I don't know. Anyway, so yes, yeah, so I've got this month's one, and this month's is Victory. So I know it has free in it. So it's sports, and my gosh, we need a bit of uh, sports in our lives, don't we? After England last night as well. So, yeah. Anyway, we saw what Wimbledon. So, <laughs> so yes. So as you can see, in the last month, I noticed now it's t uh, in association with Crunchyroll. So it's where you can watch anime and you can watch it exclusive from Japan the very next day after it's released in Japan, and it, it's five pounds a month. So I've I've got it, and it's really good. So I've got so much anime I'm still catching up with now. And on Loot Crate, if you have a Crunchyroll account and if you connect it to your Loot Anime, you get five dollars off, which is about three pounds depending on the exchange rate at the moment. So that's something to know. I don't know if it's continuous or it's just for a month, but well, I'll I'll double check and see when I'm charged next time for the next couple of months and see. Right, so without further ado, let's open the box. Right, so let's have a look. Oh, <laughs> I'm seeing what one of the items here is already. I'm actually quite glad. So <laughs> let's have a look at the shirt. First of all, I have, <gasps> I've just seen one of the items. <sighs> I'm so happy. Oh, I like this. Um, I, is this from, wait, I have the, <laughs> Yes, I think it is. I think this is from uh, Yoamushi Pedal, which is the cycling. Yes, it is. It's from the cycling anime. So yes, yeah, there's Bicycle Racing Club on the back. Oh, wow. That is awesome. I like the way that Loot Crate are bringing out the anime theme shirts. I mean, last month, the Yokai Watch shirt was of the main character. So if you wanted to do a cosplay of it, Bob's your uncle. I mean, I know uh, they have the the watches on sale now here in the UK. When I went to Japan, I got one. I got one for the main character and then the female character. I don't know their names, unfortunately, from the top of my head. But um, that's really cool. I think I might wear that to, I don't know, to a few. Yeah, there you are. It says uh, Yoamashi uh, Yo Pedal. If you don't know what it is, it's a cycling anime. It's it's another sports anime. I haven't watched it in full. I've only seen a few episodes when I when I was doing the podcast. So that's another one I do have to carry on with. And that's a really nice shirt. And I love the colour of it as well. It's, especially for the summer. Well, I haven't had much of a summer at the moment from what I can see. So um, one of the items I've just seen here. It's it's a squid from Splatoon. So. Let's get this one open very quickly. I love Splatoon. I've, I've cosplayed as an Inkling, as the female Inkling from Splatoon, which is... Uh, it's, a, it's a brilliant game. It's one of those ones that's frustrating, but it's it's kind of a um, territorial kind of game. It's kind of how much can you paint before the end of the match, and it's really good. They also do the themed days as well. I haven't actually played Splatoon in such a long time. I should really get back into it. So yes, this is the squid from Splatoon the main one. Uh, green is usually the main colour. So that's awesome. I don't have actually a plushie. I have like a, a hat. I've got a few amiibos of, um, of Splatoon. I've got the sisters due I think next week, Hallie and Mari. And that was another thing I found out when I was in hospital that I didn't realise it was being released. So straight away pre-order. So that's awesome. That's going to go up amongst the, uh, the, the, the gang of plushies here behind me. So that's really cool. Right, next we have the Loot Crate, well, 
the anime, we don't have a pin, we have a topper for your phone. And it's a trophy, and it has on the back eight, so I'm guessing this is the eighth box now for loot anime, I think so. And um, I got the Unity last month, it was two feathers, which was really nice, so I've kept one for myself, I've given the other one to my boyfriend. I actually really like these, these are really cute to collect, I still have the, um, the last few from the month, last month. Unfortunately on my phone I don't really have a, um, an option to put it, I can put it in there but I'm always listening to music and knowing me I'll put this down and I'll lose it. So I just tend to stick these on the keyring and I just kind of, um, as and when I need them, I just kind of bring them around. So that's really nice. And I love the way the colour as well, it's gold, so it kind of lasts a lot longer as well. So apart, f like I said before, we do have three items in here. Three, as in anime free. And one of them is a luggage tag. <laughs> I know for, um, Luke Crate have done this before, they've given me uh, a luggage tag. They gave me a Harry Potter one before. And it's just the main characters, all the main characters from what, because I haven't watched three. And I'm not going to lie, it wasn't my cup of tea. I know loads of people loved it, I'm, I don't have anyone against Love and Free, it's just I just couldn't get into it. I'm, I might need to watch it again, I don't know. And as you can see here, they have the characters, they're associated by different uh, sea creatures. So that's what they have here, and it's kind of like a floaty one. I, I, I'm going to keep it in its packaging, because I'm probably going to give this to someone I know who is a Free fan. And... You know, it says here, it, it's kind of liquidated, so don't cut it with that. So I'm going to keep that in the package, and I'm going to give that to someone who is a free fan, probably next time at an event, and just say, here you go, use that for your luggage. Because I don't know if it has anything at the back that you can write your name on it or anything like that, so... Yeah, there you go. <laughs> next free item, and this one I'm keeping. It's a water bottle. And this one, it's a changeable one, so... Here we go, so warm, there's nothing on it, and cool, it has all the main characters, so I'm going to open this up. Because at the moment I need to keep really hydrated, so if, if I'm going out I always bring a bottle of water with me. So this is perfect now to... Oh, that's really nice actually. Pretty, yes. So. Oh cool, and it has like a clip on so I can attach it to my, uh, to my bag if I need to. That's handy actually, and yeah, you can you can vaguely see the characters here at the front. They're faded out, so it's kind of like one of those um, sensitive ones. So instead of it being warm, you know, most of them, if you add heat to them, like the Goku ones, for example, when you heat it up, he kind of goes into his power move. Instead, if it make well, it makes common sense, because water, you know, cold water. <laughs> I'm guessing, I don't know. That's that's really nice. So yeah, I'm definitely keeping that, but the luggage tag I will definitely give away. Okay, so before I get show the last item, let's just show the poster, as I have done before, and it's a giant poster as always. These are really cool posters, I really like them. I, I've got a collection of them. I have no room on my wall for any of them, but they are really nice to keep. So, yeah, it has all the items this month, the theme, victory, and we'll get, oh yeah, so it does have a, um, where you can write it down, so that's cool. And then at the front it has the victory symbol, you can see, if not I'll just do that again as I usually do. And then last, but by no means least, and this is one I'm going to look forward to reading, it is the manga of Yawamushi Pedal. And here we go. So, power peddling, uh, Sakabichi Onoda has been, a, has, bleh, has long been conquering the steepest slopes and regularly make, making the 90 kilometer round trip to Akibara on his mummy bike. But when his bike commute to his new high school lands him in a confrontation with a serious first year road racer, uh, Imazumi, Onada has a major showdown on his hands. Can this meek geek really outpedal the future ace of the school road racing team? There it is on the back. So, yeah, it's just one of those, I think it's one of those stories where geek becomes a very popular character. And I have heard it's really good. It's just one I haven't really continued on with. I'm one of these people, I watch a few episodes of the anime, never carry it on, and then watch it when it's kind of not as popular as it used to be, so I'm very late coming to these situations. I will promise I will give free another go. 
<laughs> I know there's two seasons of it. I, I don't know. I think probably because there was so much hype around it. Um, and I, I probably didn't... I don't know. I'll see. I'll give it a rewatch and, and see. So, to recap, let's have a look at the stuff we've got. So, we have the Yawamashi pedal shirt. Which I'm looking forward to wearing that very soon. We have the squid from Spatu. We have, where is it? It's here. We have the luggage tag from Free. We have the water bottle from Free. We have the tag or the uh, earphone thingy charm. That's it. I'm trying to think of the word. I couldn't think of it. We have the poster and then we have the Yawamushi pedal manga. I'm actually pretty impressed with this month. Um, because last month it only had a few items in it, it only had four items and I thought, oh, okay, that's pretty small because the music one had a lot of items in it and I was really impressed with that. So, I don't know what the theme for next month is. Oh yes, the box. So, it's the style of a lockup. You just fold it around if you want to make a, a makeup, it makes it softer, locker. I tend to just keep these boxes or I have still have the couple left down there so I'll probably keep them for storage. They're really handy for that. So. Well. So, before I go, um, as you can tell, yeah, I'm slowly recovering day by day. I'm walking a lot more. I'm driving now, which is fantastic. Um, hopefully, you won't be put off by this. This is this is now what was left of when the trekking was taken out. So I have to air it now. So that's why I have to wear these low cut shirts for now because I can't irritate it. So, events wise, like I said, I'm not going to be able to make Amicon or others like that. I'm hoping, and this is a very, very, very slim line chance, because I don't know yet, because I still have to have a operation for my gallbladder, there may be a chance I might make it to Summer of Sonic, because I have pledged a Kickstarter to it. And it's in London, so it's easy to somewhat get to, because I haven't been on public transport yet, I've only been driving. So I'm I'm really hoping I can make it to SOS. It's not 100% confirmed yet. It just depends on when, like I said, I'm going to have my operation. Because the week before, I have my appointment with the consultant in regards to the operation, whether I'm fit enough to have it or not. I'm hoping I am. So hopefully I would like to make it because it's the last one. And also... It's the 25th anniversary, and also I get to see friends there as well, which I haven't seen since since March, actually, since properly Minamicon, and then before that Expo in October, and then a few people who are going as well. I'm, I'm really gutted I can't make Amicon, um, but yeah, travelling that far, and in case something happening, you don't know because even at this point another stone could release you know because that's what happens when you, you have to pass it through and I'm hoping from now until then nothing happens so yeah I'm hoping I can make it it will probably only be for a few hours though because you know start the ball rolling again in regards to the conventions I doubt I'll be taking photos I'll just have my camera phone on me to take it because at the moment my hands are still kind of um unsteady so for me taking the camera is like shh, shh, it's gonna come out really blurry <laughs> so that's it for me and I uh if you have any ideas of any videos you want me to do I have plenty of spare time now from now until when I go back to work so if you want any suggestion for videos if you want me to do reactions let's plays might be a bit difficult I'm only restricted to pc games at the moment um there's a lot of animes I still need to catch up with so if you want me to do reactions to that I can do that I'm very happy to. So that's it for me and I shall chat to you all soon. Bye!